Thelma 6 is the fifth Behemoth album uh, from 2000. So here we are celebrating a 20th anniversary. Wow, time flies. There's still songs on that record that I dig a lot. Some of those songs we still play uh, live, like Anti-Christian Phenomenon, uh, Christians to the Lions. I remember the Youth Manifesto, 23. I wrote that song when I was actually 23, and it was like a summary, a very emotional summary of uh, who I was back then and where I was in my life. So very emotional, very personal touch to the record. Uh, pretty diverse album with a weird sound. I'm not really the biggest fan of the sound, like from time prospect, it's not really uh, what I dig much today. But back then it was, it was a game changer. I mean, we get a lot of um, very positive response um, because of the sound, because it would, the, the clarity of the sound. And, and you know, you could really hear like every single beat, every instrument. So yeah, um, new lineup as well. We welcome Havok. It was his debut. Uh, we welcome Nove. It was it was his debut on bass and Behemoth. So a lot of you know new components coming together. New sound, new label because it was avant-garde music and massive, uh, 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 a crazy number of shows all across Europe. We just. Uh, so yeah, I, I dig out some of my archives and um, yeah, I find out this uh, Repentia uh, magazine cover. That was one of the very first covers we would get. I don't know if you can see much, but this, I don't think we have ever, we have ever presented that photo. Another photo. Now look at this six pack. <laughs> so dehydrated. We were touring uh, with Christian and uh, Vader across Poland and I believe that photo was taken in Gdańsk after the show. You can see my parents, Irene and Zenon and myself drinking cold beer after the show. It was actually a really good one. I remember the show. We had never presented that photo of that. I mean, it was a separate photo session that I took with uh, my friend Sada. Uh, so the band wasn't accompanying me. It was just me just fucking around at some old uh, railway station, I believe. There's two photos, live photos, that I've been using around the Telema 6 era. This photo, I was wearing this terror shirt. Not very original like these days, like in every second kid, you know, is wearing that shirt. But back then it was, a, it was cool. I was wearing that shirt quite often too, a wanted with Jesus Christ figure face on it it was cool so yeah uh, a lot of shows we still wouldn't make it to US uh, but I was desperate to you know to bring that very music to the United States of America actually Thelema.6 was the first album that we would license to an American label on um, on professional professional terms so I think that licensing that album on Olympic, which was a sub label of Century Media, brought us to the direct deal with Century Media for uh, Zoskia Kultus and then Demigod. So yeah, very important album. I still dig it. And I know there's plenty of, you know, among you legions who, who love that record. So it's back to all the platforms, I hope, all the Spotify's and, and um, Apple Music. So go back and refresh your memory, pick up the songs you like, and play them, you know, on repeat and enjoy it. And you, every now and then, you'll hear and see Behemoth performing those songs live. Enjoy it. <laughs>